Today we learn how to read JSON file using AngularJS and display that data in a UI. Now let us a JSON file. Make a JSON file imply.json JSON and there is like ID, name, gender, value. Basically JSON file contain key and their value means property name id and their value this way they here you see the record 2 and record 3 and record 4 and record 5 this is a content of array which contain the imply information of 5 people now go to visual studio 2015 make a html file or make any editor you want like notepad dreamweaver or visual studio or any editor which you want to like the editing now let us understand one by one here we have defined title implied details and we have used here angular version 1.619 and we have already included js angular.js which are here like this license version and there is a function in it, a lot of function there now move to the script file and that is body first we understand body element like ng app equal to mp app my app define here and there is div imply information and here we have defined ng controller equal to emp controllers and that is tag h1 and that is uh, headlines of the grid basically there is no grid here we have to show data like grid uh, we uh, find associative tables and a row basically that is headlines and mm -hmm. here he show mm -hmm. the data in tr you have to repeat the row then ng repeats works like a looping and there is employees EMP and that is their sure. value getting for imply dot id imply name first go to the implies where you define the the js you write js function to get data from the imply dot json file here we define here where mp equal to angular dot module that is module and mp app and mp app dot controller controller name and function scope and http basically http let us understand what is http uh, angular js http angular js http service it is a service basically allow us to communicate with other servers using the browser xml http request object or json p means if you use http it can be request to it provide the service allow us to communicate between the two servers like uh, files or uh, file that file in another server uh, this will be accessed by xml http equation now go to the our functions like we uh, define a scope a scope dot form this is a home page and here you have write like http target method that is a file name or here you have put uh, any url web api url or web service url then if you define get function then we will call here then function get then function success callback then a response and we have defined a employees 
variable like score dot employee is equal to response dot data response data that will be available to employees scores and that employee will be available to ui means view and also you can see data in console.log response that will display the data in console in the case of any error then function will go here like response and console.log perform like unable to perform get request also you show the uh, message in ui means view labels uh, that is functions where you have get data from another servers or uh, uh, json files okay now come to the ui here we have defined like our data will be in employees score dot employees score dot imply nothing but a variable we get the data from the request to response and that variable will be available in the ui like here and you repeat define a emp dot employees and imply that id imply dot name imply dot gender imply dot salary imply dot bonus and imply dot salary and this imply dot bonus here we get the data from the json file imply json files and repeat until data will be finished now run this page like read json file and open in browsers now let us see Employee functions have defined headlines and that is your version used. Angular JS version used here 1.6. And <coughs> here we see uh, headlines means tag, name, gender, salary bonus, and grid headlines, grid headings, and that is a value like ID, name, mail, salary, and bonus total salary. Thus, here we see the data from the JSON file get and showing a UI. Thank you for guys. If you want to more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.